Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Okay, um, last week I told you I went some like adventuring and grad sailing and all that stuff. So I wanted to show you what I got. Some, most, is craft supplies. Um, today is Thursday and I went today too. I got a better deal I think today, but I haven't checked it all out. I figured I'd do it with you guys on camera. So, first thing, we're just going to pop right in here. Yes, I am sitting in my chair. Um, my leg is killing me. So, I'm not going to sit at my table. No. Um, I got my machine, though. What, what? I got it yesterday. Um, could not do it by myself. Hubby, tooth is out. Um, hurts like a mother, Hubbard, he said, because <laughs> the stuff went away. <laughs> but he's okay, he says. So. Um, yeah, so let's get started. First thing I got was a punch. And I paid uh, 75 cents for it. It worked just fine. So, awesome, awesome. Next thing I had gotten were these, um... Tina from Tina Crafty Life said when she does her inks and her backgrounds, instead of doing that Tim paper and stuff, that one paper, you can use photo paper. So I ended up getting these. Um, they were together. I think. I'm not even going to say. I want to say it was like just a book, but I'm not for sure. Um, but what was weird on this one I don't know if you guys have ever seen these. Okay. Look, it's got an arrow in this. Like, it literally... What? Yeah, I know, right? And it perforates, so then you just have the 4 by 6 But I'm thinking that would be cool if you did your inks, and then you just had these to go for, like, little parts. Thought that was kind of snazzy. Snazzy, snazzy. So, there's a 100 sheet in this one, and about 60 in this one, so I picked them up so I can play with my inks. Sorry, guys, my eyeball is killing me. Alright, next thing I, I had come across, and I paid 5 bucks for all. They put it all in here. Um, there were a whole bunch of stamps. Oh, do I have a piece of paper? I do. What? I do. For the first time, I actually have one. So, there is one set of stamps that I had gotten. Um, this one I think you could see. I don't know if I'll ever use these. The alphabet. I'm just not into doing that. Um, like I said, like I got all these for five. She put them, she was getting ready to... Which was good because, like, I don't have thank you. And then I'm like, I always have a problem with that. So then it gives you a whole bunch of what you can do with all the words you have. Which was kind of cool. Then I ended up getting... These are brand new. There's only one I see, maybe two, that she actually used. So, kind of cool. So I did that. And when I go... Gratzilla, I'm looking for okay craft supplies. It's fine. Um, Zach has grown like a weed, so we're looking for like clothes for him, just summer clothes for just out. You know what I mean? Like not school clothes, but farm clothes. I guess I'm gonna say it that way. Can I even get it in here? Hold on, I gotta get these in here. Hold on. So then, guys. I went to a couple grad sales and I got some chains. I left the, left them over there though. This the bigger sheet and I paid fifty cents for I don't know eight sheets. I, this I got these before I got them, so I thought that's all right. It's all good. So and then I bought this whole thing and I've already gotten some of this for ten cents. And really, all I wanted it for was the folder. And 
the paper was just extra. That's kind of what I thought. All right. This is going to be long if I don't hurry my butt up. All right. So the next thing I went and I got all this. And you're like, what in the heck is that? Oh, I do apologize. I'm making loud noises. And everything else. Okay, there we go. So, these are, and I don't know how to work them exactly yet, but they're 3D mass bracket um, to create more breathing space. Okay? They're, like, it's all unopened. They never did any of it. So it helps. I don't know. But this whole bag, this entire bag. Now these I opened because I used one of them. Um, or a buck. Um, I figured if anything, I would donate them if, I, if they didn't think they worked or, you know. But you see these things on TV all the time and they are like five bucks a piece, if not higher. Dollar for the whole bag. Alright, so... Here we go. This. Oh, man. What is all in here? Okay. Oh. All right. The same. The same. Sorry. My bag is just being a pain in my butt. All right. So the same garage sale that I had that. It was a free box. So I went in the free box. Because she's like, hey, if you like this, maybe you like these. So I got. Okay. I got this. I want to show you that real quick. This was in the free box. Nothing wrong with this book. I mean, it's old. It's old, right? Yeah. All right. So I'm just going to try to get all these up. Every single one of these was in the free box. And they actually fit my mask. Um, but they're the filters. The five, uh, 10 piece, five ply carbon filter, non wove cloth filters. She had them in the free box. Guys. All of them. Seriously. I'm like, I didn't understand it. I was like, okay. Then I seen this. And this is what I wrote. I just wanted the tin. Okay. Tin to do some crafty and then gift it, right? I didn't think it was. I opened it. Brand spanking new. It's got the thing, the poker for like your compute, like your thing, or pull, push, and the keychain. Brand spanking new. Two of them. What, what? Yeah, some of these ladies around here just are not with it. So, there that is. Yay. Alright, so the rest of the stuff was at what we call a curiosity shop. Um, that's all the real garage sale stuff that I got. My mom got some things, but, um, curiosity shop. So this was last week and I'll, then I'll show you the stuff I got this week. So here we go. It was fill a bag. I ended up getting two movies that my husband's already taken from me, a pair of jeans, a couple books that my mom wanted, and then the rest of this. You ready? Let's go. All right. It's a never ending bag. Ready? One. Mind you, this whole bag was five bucks. Had lace. After <laughs> lace. Vintage lace. Look. Okay, let's go that way. Um. Oh! I'm going to put it all on my lap for now couple like this. Now, I've already cut some and sent some of this to somebody. Look at that. I mean, I got a whole bunch of this. Like, I kid you not when I say, okay, so this is the, like that. Um, then this was in here. I figured if I was going to do it, I was going to do it good. I had to figure out five. And I know it's more of a vintage thing because of where it used to go. 
Like this had to be at least in the well the eighties on this. Because Walmart don't carry this anymore. So there's that. Um some it some isn't. Look at this. Look at this whole big thing. And I had to take it out of the off of the thing so I could store it. I haven't stored it yet. I haven't got into my or my blue, never ending blue. There's the blue. Purple. I mean, it goes on and on, ladies and gents. Ruffle. Red. Here's my thought. This is, you know, you can tell how vintage this is. Look at that. A whole flipping spool of it. I can't even imagine. Oh, that hurts. Ouch. Uh, this, you know, it was in there. Like, you fill the bag, and I just, whatever was in that stuff, I just put in there. Here is, um, nine foot of, like, a glossy. Look at that. So, with one pair of women's jeans, like this, I know, it was cut off of something, but look how gorgeous that is. Um, one pair of my jeans would be worth the five bucks. And I have this, which I'm not too for sure and not too keen about this. I would actually cut more of it up like they are. But it's kind of cool for what it is. I mean, I never seen be cool for like a St. Patrick's Day thing. Uh, let's see. Black. And there's white of this. A lot of black. Uh, then um, uh, I want to say a mint. I, that's what I'm going to call it a mint. So it fell out of my bag. In my bag. It wasn't supposed to. Um, how cool, right? These are my scavenger hoods. Alright, it's in this bag. Alright, so I'll put it in a Walmart bag so it'd be easier. Alright. This is from, okay, this is how I know it's old. Um, Belmont Stores. That was, there hasn't been a Belmont store in Indiana, if any, since I was like five or six. So, hmm, just saying. So it's 80s at least. Keep going, it keeps going. All this. And there's this one, which is cool. I'm going to take it out of the package, but look. There's one, two, three, four, at least. And that. More black. Oh, man, come on. More black. We're on 12 minutes already. Um, so I'm going to have to do the next one in the video. I'm just going to look at that. Look, like, what, what? Okay. Two more things, and then we will call this. So this was all last week's finds. So then you have, can you see that? Sorry. I'm trying to make this best for me. And then the pink. And then one more. West Philadelphia, born and raised. Oh, there you guys have it. That is my um, kind of garage sale scavenger hunt that I found crafty-wise last week. So, um, I have so much that I hit in one garage sale that I'm going to have to do another video for it, I guess. Because I didn't think it'd take this long for this. But, it did. So, that's okay. So, guys, if you guys like these kind of videos... 
let me know down below. Um, I have some friend mail I started to do yesterday, and now I have to redo because my husband should come out of the thing. So I'm going to be doing that. So the next couple of days, you will be seeing some probably pre-recorded because normally on the weekends, I do not record unless I absolutely have to um, or going live. I don't know yet. I might be. Who knows? But yeah, I'm breaking out. I hate that with little blusters. So guys, if you like these, let me know. Um, anything going on other than that? Nope, I don't think so. Till next time, I want to wish everybody a happy Thursday. See you soon. Bye, guys.